everyone welcome back to my channel so i'm gonna go ahead and light a candle for us in here i am using this candle to death literally burning it to death definitely my favorite fall scent and i am kicking myself for not just like stocking up and getting more of these i need to go by target i truly just want to fill my house with this scent all year round i made myself some raspberry hibiscus tea so hi my name is Zaya. if you're new around here recently my channel had a name change we are now cozy planting i talked about this in my last video so if you want to get up to date with some of those changes definitely go watch that video but right now i'm wearing the cardigan that i ended up buying in that last video and oh my gosh you guys it is so comfortable like it literally feels like i'm being snuggled up by a teddy bear it feels so so nice so for today's video, I wanted to share another little cozy vlog with you. And most of the footage that I ended up filming was actually from Monday. I had the house to myself that morning and afternoon, so I dedicated it to some plant maintenance and then also to some self-care. We can go ahead and have a nice chat at the end of this video, but for now, get cozied up and I'll put some good music for you so we can go ahead and get started. Cheers, friends. on my list of things that I wanted to try that day was to make my own soup. So I decided to make a zucchini and tomato soup. I thought it would turn out really nice. And the only thing that I would have changed would have been to add more tomatoes or something like that to give it more of that color because I definitely feel like the zucchini took over. So I would definitely have to give the experience of making the soup 10 out of 10 stars and then the actual taste part would probably be like 8 out of 10 stars. I think it definitely needed some more of that tomato flavor for sure, at least for my taste buds. <laughs> Are spinning round in my head. I both so sit down. Cause I'm almost there. Now I see you through the window and I'm walking on there. But I won't let you know. And I know how it goes. It's supposed to feel incredible. It's too bad. Thank you. 
So it is actually Sunday right now and this video should have already gone up but this is all a part of what I was talking about in my last video how I'm going to try to just take it easy and enjoy the process of editing my videos again and sharing them with you and all of that good stuff so because of that this video will be going up a little bit later in the day Sunday or Monday depending on what part of the world you live in but something that I did want to share with you is we had a little accident <laughs> in the plant room. I don't know how it happened. So my philodendron burl marks that you see behind me in some of my videos, I ended up checking on her during this week. Just saw that a part of her completely fell off. I, I really don't know how it happened, but right now I have it propagating in water and I'm thinking that this cutting itself will probably be too much to propagate, but I'm just gonna leave it in here and see if it roots up in about a week or so. If it doesn't, then I'll chop it up a little bit more so that way the roots can go ahead and have an easier time developing, but we'll see. I will I will keep you updated, but look how huge this cutting is. I was so sad, but it's not the end of the world. We can repropagate and put it back into the plant. But yeah, there is that little update. Also, I've been working on a little project here in the office space. I don't know if you can see it, behind me i i am so excited that's going to be its own dedicated video but i thought i'd give you a little sneak peek so follow me so i ended up working on this peg wall right here and last night my husband helped me mount it up and i'm so excited i spray painted it and i'm gonna go ahead and order some more little baskets so this is not the final look but it was fun to start playing around with it that way i could get a gist of what i wanted to do i'm gonna go ahead and display my tools display some plants it's gonna be a really fun time and then this lamp up here is not going to stay there but again i just wanted to get a picture of what it was going to look like because i'm going to go ahead and purchase the lamp that i want to have so i can have a little grow light there for all the plants that are here but yeah that is the little sneak peek of what i've been working on and here's the video that i'm going to be uploading today which is what you're watching so very meta situation but yeah so hello welcome back if you've made it to the end of this video i thought we could go ahead and end with a little chat i just want to start off by saying thank you so much for all of the sweet comments on my last video being vulnerable <laughs> online is very very hard it does not matter how long you've been on youtube i've been making videos on here for three years and it's still something 
that is very very difficult and i just want to thank you all for being so kind and so sweet and reminding me of the ways that my videos have helped you too it truly never gets old for me to read comments like that so thank you all so much and here's to continuing to create more cozy content so to change the subject just a little bit i'm really excited because i'm going to start filming my fall house plant tour part of me really didn't want to do it because it feels like my plants aren't all exactly where i want them to be and then i stopped myself and realized that that's the whole point that's part of the fun getting to see how placement changes every season and i want to do it with a more relaxed feel to make it fun because in the past whenever i have filmed my houseplant tours i'm really really proud of them but they have taken so much energy but i feel like now with the current plant size that i have that i feel really good about it shouldn't take me as long and i'm actually really excited to show you guys some of the new growth even if things aren't placed exactly where i want it to be i know you all always let me know that you look forward to those plant tours and i feel really excited again to get to film those and to share it with you and i also better hurry the hell up because fall is basically <laughs> almost over so yeah that is definitely on the agenda and then i also have already pre-filmed another video that i'm going to be sharing with you because i've been working on cozying up my office as you guys saw in my last video and that is definitely an ongoing process but the project that i'm going to be sharing with you that i'm working on should definitely be the last thing that i plan on doing in the office for a good while but filming wise i decided that it would probably be better to just create that as its own video that way i could share with you like the process and you could see the end result so that will also be coming up self-care for me this week has definitely been all about taking time to slow down be mindful care for my plants and also make hard decisions and that's the hard shit about self-care that isn't really talked about too often because it's not so fun all the time to prioritize yourself or to make really hard decisions even though you know it's going to be the healthiest thing for you in the long run but sometimes self-care does look like that and it's very necessary so all of that has been a part of my week in the past few weeks as you all have seen definitely leave me a comment down below and let me know what you've been doing for self-care this past week or what your self-care plans look like is it some type of planty activity another creative hobby or making some hard decision here's to that because it can be really hard sometimes but once again thank you so much for hanging out with me and for watching stay cozy everyone and i will go ahead and catch you in my next video bye